Alrighty, so for our next one, we've got a little party trick for you, okay? And it comes down to the valuable thing that is balance. Okay, so first and foremost, it's a really simple thing to nail and often people think, oh, I've either got bad balance or good balance. No, you've just got a poor pattern of movement to put you in that position. And it's really easy to fix, okay? So Frank's gonna stand on one leg facing uh, you guys and she's gonna try her very best to balance. But if you're standing on one leg and you've got a sloppy spine and therefore pelvic position set up, you're gonna wobble everywhere, okay? So the intention here is to think about your spine getting long. That means thoracic extension, belly button drawing in, and that whole support system that is your tummy muscles into your hips switches on. Bang. And by doing that, you're connecting everything all the way through, and then all the work has to happen down at the ankle and the lower part of the leg, okay? And that's really what we want when it comes to balance. There's a nice straight body, and all the work happens down the bottom. Just like a pull cue in your hand, the same principle is you're just now balancing using the muscles of your ankle and your feet, okay? And if you think about that position and think about the way you run, if Frankie turns around into her balance, her face the other way, we're looking at her pelvis. If she stands on one leg and drops the hip this way, okay, that puts her pelvis in a really compromised position, okay? What we need is the lift of the pelvis to square up that spine to get long and belly button to draw in. The force will then be generated by the hip, the knee and the ankle accordingly, but this leg then does the work. You lose your pelvis or your balance on your running gait, you're gonna lose the efficiency and therefore put a lot of stress in places you don't want stress when it comes to running. So your balance is a really important thing, particularly if you wanna get good at running or you play field-based sports. You spend a lot of time on one leg when you're running, you need to be able to balance well to then run well. So consider that next time you're gonna go for a run, a little bit of work on the muscles and the system that generates balance, you're probably gonna set yourself up quite nicely to feel a lot more efficient. Go and enjoy.